Up to date, it's about 20,000 k's I've travelled just to get to this first game. Today, I had to not work so I could make it to training because um, we've got a new driver for the courier company um, and things are a little bit out of sorts at the moment. But my boss has been pretty flexible, which is wonderful. To have that flexibility means I can get here. Yeah. We started training on the 9th of January, I think it was. So the last two and a half months, whatever it is. Well, it's the only, only way I can play rugby um, because there's nothing down home um, and I've committed now so I'll see it through. There's definitely something that I like doing. Actually, I love doing it. It's lots of fun. <laughs> but yeah, today's going to be a long day because usually I stay up the night with work. Today, I'm turning around going home after training. I wouldn't recommend it to anybody. It's, it's a long, hard road. <laughs> but no, it's myself, I, I find it's worth it. And next week I'll get up and I'll do it again. When I was 16, I met a guy that actually trained the Denmark high school boys. So that was where that came from. I don't ever play soccer or footy at school and rugby was awesome. You got to tackle people and even though it was just a male sport at the time, there wasn't anything to say that we couldn't do it. It was just not heard of a lot. I definitely wanted to play it. It's, it's not functioning at the moment. I mean, the club is still there, but there's no team. There was a group of guys that were about my age that were happy to have me training with them. So that was really, really good. We did try getting a girls rugby club team together. Um, I think there was about seven of us and we trained for probably only a couple of months. We were looking at putting a sevens team in, but it never eventuated because the girls couldn't commit to the travel, unfortunately. There was a couple of other girls from Albany that had been and done the same thing. Um, I think there was a couple of uni girls had transferred up and played with the uni club. I heard that it was on. Um, there was a couple of Facebook posts and the girls from Palmyra were talking about it through the Facebook page and I saw that it was on. And I put my hand up and said, I'll come too. But to actually play in this sort of a competition is pretty amazing. It's just the sport itself is so much fun, plus you get to bond with all the girls that are there having fun with you and to, to be part of the first actual force squad that's starting the Super W, it's amazing.